Hello, this is Gothic King Kong 52 with. I got a job working at Burger King, so I got money. I get days off. So far, I've gotten Tuesdays and Wednesdays off. So, first paycheck Monday. That's really exciting. And I got for CD done a long time ago, so that's really good. Um, there. Now, you've seen videos, my videos before, you see that my songs did change. I had to cut the CD shorter because the 20 songs didn't fit on the CD like I wanted them to. And most of them had to be redone because I lost a lot of them. So, anyway. You know, so most of them had to be re-recorded, and I decided to split the remaining songs that wouldn't fit onto a second CD, which I'll make, which I'm making right now. My first CD is Blood Cemetery, my artist name, King Cobra, my initials, JFS, and the parental advisor sticker, and you saw that. my sunglasses off. Um, but today's guitar inside is a repeat of one and an add-on to something new, particularly YouTube commenters. You know, some YouTube commenters are decent people, they seem like by the comments you can tell they're wise with their comments, but some people just fucking suck. Like, They'll sit there making an obnoxious comment just because they can, because they know I'm not going to like the video. So they'll sit there at fucking 4 in the morning watching YouTube or whatever, in their mom's fucking basement, you know, making negative, nasty comments about videos they know I'm not going to like, but they'll watch them. Anyway, it's like the show If You Really Knew Me on MTV. They should do something like that only for YouTube. It'd be like, and here's, here's what it would say. Here's what it would say about the um, nasty YouTube commenters. They would say, if you really knew me, you'd know I'm a 40-year-old virgin who jacks off to channel porn and watches videos he knows that I know I'm not going to like just so I can leave an nasty comment because I'm an immature douchebag. That's what it would say if the show You Really Knew Me came to YouTube and, it the sh and the segment was on immature YouTube commenters. And particularly, it's the commenters, shit, a screen, it's the commenters on YouTube who leave shit about Cradle of Filth isn't true. And, um, like Revenge of Godzilla, he had a video called Cradle of Filth where he made fun of Cradle of Filth and just went off on a humongous tyrant about Cradle of Filth, which he knew nothing about. Okay, people who hate Cradle of Filth and hate them because they think they're an emo band, well, they're not, okay? I am getting sick and tired of people calling them an emo band. They're not. I challenge you to study their information, study their history, the band profiles, to stop calling them gay and shit because Danny Filth is not gay. Okay, I'm sick of people calling him gay because they're using it as an insult. Well, really, he's not. He has a wife and a daughter, so shut the fuck up. Second of all, and more emo bands would be like Bolt for My Valentine and Chem My Chemical Romance. Take those two bands, each song, both are emo bands, alright? Take both those bands. And compare them to a Cradle of Filth song. There's a humongous difference. And if you can't see that, you're musically ignorant. Like, emo music tends to be more whiny. Kind of like, ah, with that really cheesy guitar. Whereas Cradle of Filth is more of a black metal sound. And one particular commenter commented saying... Cradle of Filth is an emo faggy band for emo faggots who listen to that shit, blah, 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 with the usual bullshit. First off, they're not an emo band, okay? I don't know how many fucking times I have to say it, but they're not an emo band. Second of all, Cradle of Filth is for anybody who enjoys their band, enjoys their music, and loves their music, you know? Uh, you know, I don't think emo music or goth music should be for just goths or emos. It should be for anyone who enjoys listening to it. So shut the fuck up and enjoy the music, seriously. And stop insulting a band you know nothing about, you know? And people are going to comment if they see my videos, they're going to say, Oh, you insult Justin Bieber and all that shit. Yeah, I do, because I don't like him. He's an annoying little douchebag, um, you know? 
And these fuckers who insult Cradle of Filth are obviously just jealous of the fact that they're famous, and they're not. They're at home, on the computer, 4 in the morning, da 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 you know, random bullshit comments. And I'll shoot this guy's ass out for it, too, big time, like, and I, I told him off, basically. And, um, this is the video. Look, if you don't believe me, okay, go to Dead and Still Dying 606's channel. There's a video uploaded called Danny Filth Insults Emos, and he, quite frankly, Danny Filth himself, insults emos, along with the rest of the band. Why, in fact, would they be emo if they're insulting them? It doesn't make any sense, because they're not emo! You know, I'm getting sick of people saying they're an emo band. It gets really old. I have to explain to people the difference between goth and emo. They don't know the difference because they don't care. And because they don't care, they automatically assume they're both the same, and that ignorant bullshit really pisses me off, you know? Fuck. <laughs> I'm pretty sure emo do get pissed off with being confused with goss. And um, as a goth, I'm pissed off about people confusing goss with emos. And, you know. So, if you're going to go off and something a band you know nothing about, I challenge you to learn the band's history and their bios of the band members, and then really listen to their sound, and then compare it to an emo band. And if you still think they're an emo band, you're fucking ridiculous. You're fucking stupid. If you still think they're an emo band after you've compared, you know, their songs to an emo band, and you still can't tell the difference, you're fucking retarded, okay? Seriously. Shut the fuck up and enjoy the music. Who cares if it's an emo band, okay? I care enough to know that the difference is the differences, and the differences are not an emo band versus like My Chemical Romance or Bullet for My Valentine. That's as far about as much as I care uh, when people say they're an emo band. Otherwise, who the fuck really cares? You know, just shut the fuck up and enjoy the music. <laughs> Put my shades back on. <laughs> I love these shades, man. These shades are fucking awesome. Anywho, I think if you're gonna, like I said, I won't say it again because people might have missed it watching the video. Cradle of Filth is not an emo band. If you don't believe me, compare them to an emo band like Bullet for My Valentine or My Chemical Romance. And then watch the video, Danny Filth and Soul's Emos. And if you still think they're an emo band, you're fucking stupid, okay? You're fucking ignorant in the head. Listen to their sound. Listen to the other people's other emo band sound, okay? Listen to an emo band sound. Listen to their sound. Listen with your ears. It can be very informative. And if you still can't see the difference, you're fucking musically ignorant. Yeah. You know, those stupid cunt sausages up on YouTube, you know, with the comments. It's ridiculous. And if you think about it too, like people on YouTube watch these videos and they could be like little kids, you know, little kids watching these videos and they're going to hear me, myself, or someone else on YouTube cussing or whatever and they're going to start repeating those words and their mom and dad are going to be like, where did you learn those words? From YouTube. And then you're going to get pissed off at YouTube. And then again, we're going to have people pissed at YouTube and it's going to lead to a more chaos. And seriously, what the fuck people, you know? God. The world's full of shit as it is. We really need more of it. Sometimes negative comments are necessary, don't get me wrong. Like if a guy's abusing his dog for YouTube entertainment, then I'd be like, fuck you, a dog abusing piece of shit. Da 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 da, whatever. <laughs> However, if if it's a guy's first time if it's a guy's first video he just made on YouTube and he doesn't know YouTube very well, he's just getting started and you leave a negative comment just to be an ass, you know. Come on people. Negative comments are necessary on some videos, and some videos are not necessary, really, you know? So, if there were ever was an episode, if you really knew me, that's what they should use for YouTube commenters, because it's about the basic truth. You know, they have no lives, and the only life the negative assholes on YouTube have is to leave negative comments on videos they don't like, but they'll watch on purpose just so they can get pissed off about it. Really? Seriously? Some of you even comment and wonder 
how my guitar strap, woohoo, my guitar strap doesn't get in the way of my guitar. Well, I will show you. If you look closely, it sits behind the guitar instead of in the front. So that's how it stays all out of my way. Also, people say you've been playing guitar for that long. Yes, I have. I've been playing since the seventh grade for as long as I have this guitar, which is since the seventh grade. And I only know chunks of songs. I'll pick it up by ear or by lesson. I'm, okay, I'm a pretty decent guitar player, but I'm not good enough to be doing gigs. I just got my own shit put together on a CD. It was so seriously. Again, I'm already getting negative comments on my videos from the 10 million negative assholes on YouTube. I actually don't give a shit, you know? I don't see them posting videos of them, you know, jamming out on guitar or whatever. So, where the fuck did my pick go? Oh, there it is. You know, I don't see them on YouTube posting videos of them playing guitar, you know, or whatever. The negative comments are just pointless and stupid. So, if you're going to be negative just for the hell of it, then shut the fuck up and get the fuck off of YouTube. If you're going to be negative because the video sucks because it was mean in a way, then yes, fine, whatever. Honestly, it's fucking rubbish. Absolute fucking rubbish. Just sit there on YouTube and like... Wow, people, you really just commented that, you know, shit like, yo, mama, ha, 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 you know, shit like that, you know? It's like, how many fucking third graders are on YouTube, and they're actually 14 or 15-year-olds making stupid-ass comments on YouTube? It's just really irritating, you know? And you can go on any video on YouTube, and there's always one or two or more assholes commenting unnecessarily on the video. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Okay, I'll, I know I look like Ozzy Osbourne, so I'll do it. Sharon! The dog pissed on the carpet again! Sharon! Well, clean it up, Ozzy! I can't, Sharon, I'm taking a shit! Sharon! There, I did it. Okay, Ozzy impersonation. Well, I, Ozzy's the shit. Ozzy rocks, man. It's one of my idols. So is Danny Filth. So, you can imagine why I get pissed off when people in Soul Creed a little filth and they have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. <sighs> People think I'm insane because I am frowning all the time. Happiness I cannot feel in love to me is so unreal. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> this is Gothic King Cobra 52. Look at the guitar inside! Ah. Wow.